Pastoral is a piece about my old English sheepdog named Agnes Cooch. Agnes was with us for 13 and a half years, which is actually ancient for a sheepdog. Um, toward the end, she was arthritic and got kind of confused. And the vet said to me, she'll tell you when it's time to go. And she did. But my daughter grew up with this dog, learned how to stand by grabbing fists full of chest hair and pulling herself from a seated to a standing position only to have her face completely licked by this adoring animal who was a steady presence in my life through the roughest period I ever experienced. She was a gentle, gentle, loving creature. And in 1986, she died. I was doing this piece, and I don't normally include animals, but this animal insisted on presenting itself and would not leave, no matter what I did. This lovely, grazing creature would not leave. And I came to realize, as the piece was developing, that I was really communicating with Agnes, or more accurately, Agnes was communicating with me to let me know that everything was fine, that she was out to pasture, that she was no longer in pain, and that all was well, life goes on. For people who understand that when I do rocks or pebbles, much of the time I come to realize that a rock or a pebble, especially in isolation, represents a person. Well, in this case, the rock that's uh, opposite Agnes represents me. And I found, after the work was photographed, the photographer said to me, did you put that deer in there deliberately? And I said, what deer? What are you talking about? He said, well, look in the middle of the piece. There's a deer. I said, you're crazy. He said, no, look in the middle of the piece. I said, I don't see any deer. He said, look at the slide. And I looked at the slide, and sure enough, there was this form of a leaping four-legged creature, kind of like a, a cave drawing of a deer or an antelope or some kind of something that was a free, leaping, joyous, spiritual kind of image. And I went, okay, I'm not messing with this. This is way too much for me. I had dealt with the pain and the disappointment of loss um, in the upper right-hand area of this piece with all the scraped out, exaggerated motion that revealed the red underneath and created that sort of elephant form. The V-shaped form that comes in and points to Agnes, I think is just a way of saying that communication continues between loved ones. But that deer I didn't plan and I didn't know was there but I sure enjoy having it there now because it's, uh, it's just proof that sometimes you make pieces and the best thing to do is not interfere with them. Just allow them to say what they want to say.